This video will show you step-by-step -step how to solve flow rate problems. For example one, you have a 120 pound patient who is to receive dopamine dosed at 25 micrograms per kilogram per minute. The dopamine solution is 1500 micrograms per ml and is to be delivered at 60 drops per ml. At what rate in drops per minute should the dose be given? So it's important to note that the patient is 120 pounds and you will have to convert that to kilograms because the dosing is 25 micrograms per kilogram per minute. The concentration of the dopamine solution is 1500 micrograms per ml and the administration is set at 60 drops per ml. And they want the rate in drops per minute. So the first step is to convert pounds to kilograms. So as we all know, there's 2.2 pounds for every kilogram. So you just divide 120 pounds by the 2.2 pounds per kilogram, and that would give you 54.5 kilograms as the weight of the patient. Then you take that weight of the patient and multiply that by the dosing, and that will let you know how many micrograms the patient is taking per minute. So 54.5 kilograms times 25 micrograms per kilogram per minute will give you a dosing of 1,363.6 micrograms per minute the patient is receiving. So now that you have the microgram, you want to change the microgram into mLs to find out how many mLs is being infused per minute. And you do this by setting up a proportion. So since the concentration of the dopamine solution is 1,500 micrograms per mL, you just equal that to the 1,363.6 micrograms the patient is receiving per minute, and that will give you the mLs. So every minute the patient is receiving, receiving 0.91 mLs of dopamine solution. Then you want to convert the mLs to drops. So since 60 drops are in every mL, I need to know how many drops are in 0.91 mLs. When you set up the proportion and cross multiply, that will give you the answer 54.5 drops per minute. So every minute, the patient is receiving 54.5 drops of the dopamine solution. For example two, you have a patient who is receiving a solution IV at a rate of 22 drops per minute. How much solution is being infused in four hours if the infusion set delivers 25 drops per ml? So the rate of infusion is 22 drops per minute, and it's four hours that the solution is being infused. And the set infusion set is set at 25 drops per ml. So first you want to convert the drops to ml and you set up a proportion. So since there's 25 drops in every ml, 22 drops is 0.88 mLs. The next step is to multiply the mLs by 60 minutes to get mLs per hour. So since 22 drops is 0.88 mLs, you multiply that by 60 minutes, and that'll let you know the patient is receiving 52.8 mLs per hour. So now that you know that the patient is receiving 52.8 mLs per hour, the patient is receiving that for four hours. So you just multiply that number by four hours and that will let you know the total volume the patient is getting over four hours, which is 211.2 mLs. Thank you for watching the video and I look forward to you watching the next one.